Hi everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your card readings for the coming week. These readings are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else and most importantly have a really enjoyable and positive week. I will be using my teacup tarot deck and I will also be using my Time to Shine Angel Oracle Card deck. So let's get right on with your readings. So Sagittarius, your overall energy here is the card the Seven of Wands. And this reminds you to be gently and kindly assertive. This reminds you to stand up for yourself. This reminds you that in your discussions and your dealings with other people, that you make sure that you are heard and also that you listen as well. This will keep you on the road to success. So this week, mindfulness for you, be gently and kindly assertive in your dealings with other people. Your help or your hurdle, we have the King of Coins. Now the King of Coins has that Midas touch. The King of Coins is success. The King of Coins is confidence personified. The King of Coins knows how to be successful. And that's the key. So it might be someone coming in here, the King of Coins, to help you on your road to success, showing you how to. So just be awake, somebody coming in to help you. The success is here, the confidence is here, and this could be the information and the steps on how to get there. The next card, the Four of Wands, is about success. This is the card of recognition. This is the card of appreciation. This card reminds you to receive with grace and gratitude. It's being recognized for everything that you do and all that you are. So we're very used to giving. It's just as important to receive as well. So a lovely card here of success and a lovely card here of recognition for you. How can we help ourselves? The nine of coins says, take some time out, rest, relax, enjoy some little luxuries, treat yourself. It's the card of enjoying the results of your hard work, taking that time out and just resting, relaxing and rebalancing. Pulling it all together, we have another nine and the nine of pencils says, Stay positive, focus on what could go right. Very often we're programmed to do the opposite. So get your focus in a positive place, focus on what's working, focus on what can go right. And the outcome card here, the Knight of Teacups is here. Now the Knights are all very fast moving energy. They all have motorbikes. Knight of Teacups comes in and says, stay balanced, stay emotionally balanced. If there's a lot going on, take a step back, take a step back, rest and relax. Take some time out. Whatever you need to do, stay positive, take time out. This will help you stay emotionally balanced. So just take it steady this week. No rushing into things, no rash decisions or rash conversations. Go steady, stay balanced, and all can be well. So let's just summarize. Be assertive, be kindly assertive, standing up for yourself. The success is here for you, and this could be somebody coming in, helping you with the next steps towards your success. Receive with grace and gratitude and take time out to rest and relax when you need to. Treat yourself to some little luxuries. Stay balanced. 
just take that time out to recharge your batteries. Focus on what could go right and stay emotionally balanced. Take that time out, just go steady, take it slowly and all can be well. Just to clarify, the three of thought says, trust that things will get better. Take some time out. We're talking about that here. Take some time out to rest. Talk things over with somebody else. Have that quality cuppa. And in that space and in that time, clarity can find you and the relaxation to help you rebalanced and stay balanced. The five of emotion says it's time to move on from the past. Follow those positive signs towards happiness. Acknowledge the past, but look what's here. Follow that sign, follow the signs, move towards joy. And the ten of thought says it's time to move on. I was just talking about moving on here. Be happy, expect things to get better. It's time to move on up, moving up that staircase of success. Expect things to improve, move on and follow happiness. So just to have a look at your mindfulness for this week from the mini mindfulness deck, your card is clarity. Take time out to clear your mind then the inspiration will appear. How lovely, we were saying that here, take time out to relax here again, time out, step back, stay balanced, time to rest and relax and the clarity will be here for you. Make that space, in the space, very often we think nothing is happening, that's when everything is happening. So I hope you have a lovely week. If you've enjoyed the reading, click that subscribe button. It's free. Then you'll get notified when I do the next one for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.